Well, it is Happy Halloween here, at least here, to give to you the 69 amazing Halloween po po Pokemon. In this Halloween special, I'm going to be naming them off and showing you what they look like. Is there anything to do? Let's get to it right now. So let's make like this, like this Pikachu and let's run right into them. Okay, uh, putting us to our first uh, one for Pokemon, and that is Bennett. Here is what Bennett looks like. Very dark, very holoistic, and very haunting, but makes a great Pokemon for Halloween. Give it up for Bennett. Okay, to our top two, and that is Fan Phantom. Here's what Phantom looks like. Top number three, and that is Yamask. Here's what Yamask looks like. Number four, and that is Mr. Mime, appears on the, on the, the list of all best Halloween Pokemon. Here is what Mr. Mime looks like. And coming into our fifth one, and that is Clofargus. Here is what Clofargus looks like. Both great Pokemon that definitely has the Halloween spirit in all of them. And now, here are the rest of them. This one goes into the ghost of Pokemon. And our sixth one that is Gengar. Here's what Gengar looks like. Then to our next one, and our seventh one, on our top 69 best Halloween Pokemon ever, and that is Grogeist. Here's what Grogeist looks like. To our eighth one, which is Mimi Kiyu. Here's what Mimi Kiyu looks like. Makes for a very interesting Pokemon. And makes a, a good one, one for the, one of the top best of Halloween Pokemon. And coming into our next one, uh, our ninth one, and that is a Drifloom. It is what Drifloom will look like. I mean, uh, looks like. Here is the picture. Another cool one that goes into a, a ghost one that's making it top, and that is at number 10, Haunter. Here's what Haunter looks like. Here is a picture. Another very interesting po uh, a Pokemon that would definitely get the chills with that one, especially what it has. And now, bring us to our next one on our, on, on our 69 top best Pokemon for Halloween, and that is Cacturn, which is the 11th one. Here's what Cacturn looks like. Here is the picture. And not just that, look what it has. It has a moon and a bat. And Cacturn you see here, looks very holoistic and very witchy green that you'll see just right here. That makes great for the best of Halloween Pokemon. And now we get into the shadows. You can see, nice and shadowy place over here. And here is where I will 
give us our um, 12th one. And that is Gorbis. Here's what Gorbis looks like. Here is the, here is the picture right to you. Making its place at the 13th spot is Parasect. Here's what Parasect looks like. Here is the, here is the picture. Not the stat, that little thing there. Definitely has pretty haunting eyes, as you can see within that one. Makes great for all best Pokemon for Halloween. Coming into a spot at our 14th one, and that is... Shedinja. Here's what Shedinja looks like. Here is the picture. Putting its way on our um, 69 top list at number 15, we have Jinx. Here's what Jinx looks like. Here is the picture right to you, right now. A pretty scary Pokemon, especially those eyes. That would definitely not just give people, people the chills, but give them the thrills with that uh, Pokemon, they'll de definitely get up to top with that one. Putting us to our top number 16. The 16th place, and that is Lampent. Here is what Lampent looks like. Here is the, here is the picture of what that will look like. Looks very haunting, um, very gothic, and uh, um, is a great one for Halloween because, not just that, it looks like it has flames upon it that you'll see right here. Makes great for the top Halloween Pokemon. Not as that, you can see in the background, perfect setting. Then we get to the sleepy part. The magical sleepy part of it all. And at our 17th place, and that is Hypno. Here's what Hypno looks like. Here is the picture. And that's that. It's also in the right setting as well, too. It looks almost as if this was like a haunted house with Hypno on the inside. That you can see right here. P perfect um, backing for the right Halloween feel to it. And from there, we can get down to our 18th placing on the list, and that is Fosslass. Here's what Fosslass looks like. Here is the picture. This one here, another sleepy one, but makes great for Halloween. And putting a space at number 19, and that is Drowsy. Here's what Drowsy looks like. Here is the picture. Putting is placing on our 20th spot, and that is Litwick. Here's what Litwick looks like. Here is the picture. Straight to you. And that is what you'll see just right here. Again, it has the uh, same flame. Same flame. Hey, that rhymes. <laughs> now, it's, that, it's also in the right setting as well, too. You can see in the, in the back, the floor, and the feet. You can see just right here. And it makes a great top Pokemon for Halloween. Because that little thing looks like... A flower candle, as you've just seen. Okay, coming um, to a spot, uh, our tw 21st spot, and that is Cubone. Here's what Cubone looks like. Here is the picture. Not just that, it also gets your bones within that one. Makes a great one for the top best Pokemon 
How about you, Pokemon? Then we get down to our next one at its 22nd place on the list. And that is. Hans. Here's what Hans looks like. Here is the picture. To its place at number 23, we have Muck. Here's what Muck looks like. Here is the picture to you right now. <laughs> That's that. It looks like Slimer almost, except not green. It is, pur it is purple that you'll see right here. To be exact, dark purple. Ooh, but makes a great one for the top best Halloween Pokemon ever. Then down to his next place, we have it. Our twenty-fourth one is uh, Darkrai. Here's that Darkrai. Looks like here is the picture. As you can see in the background here, it's look like a vortex that coming straight from the hollows of vortex. Perfect Pokemon and makes 69 top, making its place in our list at 24. Houndoom takes its place at our 25th one. Here is the picture of what Houndoom looks like. Here it is. Very underground and full of the hollows within this one because it has the bones and the dark look for the all hallows that you'll see just right here. Not as that, it goes into almost what looks to be like like almost the beginning of a hellhound as you can see in this picture. And then we get Slab Slably which makes its place at our 26th spot. Here is the picture of what Slably looks like. Putting us to our spot at number 27, we have Sneasel. Here's what Sneasel looks like. Here is a, a picture. Murkrow takes its place here on our list at our spot 28. Here's what Murkrow looks like. Here is a picture to you right now. And it too has its right setting where the uh, Hollow's trees are and makes great for Halloween because it involves crows, which is uh, the one that you see just right here. A crow of fun with that one. Putting us way down to our space at number 29, we have Zorula. Here is what Zorula looks like. Here is the picture. To our 30th spot we have is Zuroric. Here's what Zuroric looks like. Here is the picture of what it looks like. <laughs> That's that. It looks almost like a werewolf. As you can see just right here. That makes great for the top best Pokemon for Halloween. Then we get Houndure, which takes its place on our list at number 31. Here is the picture. Almost just like a werewolf because it has the moon, the same as the owns, but this is different. This one here is part of an evolution, as you can see just right here. Makes great for top Pokemon, the best of Halloween. Best Pokemon ever. Making its place on our 30, on our 30 second spot, and that's Hans Crow. Here's what Hans Crow looks like. Here is the picture. Again, in the right setting, we got the blood red moon, we got the crow, but this time it's more majestic. And swooping down, as you can see in this picture. This one here goes to the Tuma of things on this one. 
as well as the spirit and bringing its way into our spot at number 33 and that is spirit tomb that is what spirit tomb looks like here is the picture straight to you right now very haunting very chilling but makes great for the top best Pokemon made best for Halloween as you can see to here in the picture not stat the perfect setting to get the clouds in our back and what appears to be windows or bars in the background in the picture to our 34th space we have is Mandibuzz here's what Mandibuzz looks like here is the picture it almost looks like a bald eagle good for Halloween not stat is also in the right setting as well too in the holistic looking vortex that you'll see it coming from in the picture. Then we get is Melamar making its appearance on our list at number 35. Here is what Melamar looks like. Here is the picture. As you can see, just right here. Very interesting, very unique, but makes great for all top best Pokemon for Halloween. Then we get Inkay making its appearance on our 36th spot. Here is the picture of what Inkay looks like. Man, coming down to our next one at our 37th spot, we have Duskull. Here is what this looks like. Here is the picture. This one not just has just a skull, but also is in the shape of a spirit as you can see in the picture. Making its way to our 38th spot, we, ha we have Mistrevis. Here's what Mistrevis looks like. Here is the picture to you right now. Whoa, look at that. Gives the breath of the hollows. Coming straight at you, like in a vortex kind of blow. Scary eyes. And the right Halloween setting, as you can see in the background. Can't forget the eye in this one. This one here goes into the clops. Not any clops, a dust clops. And dust clops makes its appearance on a list at spot number 39. Here is the picture. Then we get to our placing at number 40. And that is another ghost one for you guys. And that is ghastly. Here's what ghastly looks like. Here is the picture. Also in the right setting has the hollows vortex, black in the background, big scary eyes, and almost looks like a vampire with the fangs that you'll see just right here in this picture. Definitely has the Halloween feeling within that one. Coming into our next one at is place number 41. We have Shuppet. Here's what Shuppet looks like. Here is the picture. Again, in this right uh, na uh, natural setting for Halloween, as that has the haunting eyes, and it is a ghost. A ghost type Pokemon, as you can see just right here in the picture. And that's how Shuppets like to shuffle. <laughs> I just had to. Coming into our next one at our 42nd spot on the list, we have Kamala. Here's a Kamala. Looks like. Here is the picture. Looks kind of sad. Kind of haunting in the aspect. That because it does have a little bit of a dark side in this one. And has the right look. Making it top on our best of Halloween Pokemon on the list up to date. Then we get to our next one. And is placing at number 43 and that is Guzzlord here's a Guzzlord looks like here is the picture straight to you right now whoa isn't that incredibly epic it is like a pumpkin like a kind of a demonic looking pumpkin evil grin and has like a creature on the top of it in a mix of a spider as you can see just here very gothic and full of Halloween within this picture as as you can see. 
This is back you the frights. But makes great for top best Halloween Pokemon ever. Coming into its place at our 44th spot, and that is Kadabra. Here's what Kadabra looks like. Here is the picture. Very magical. Not a stat, you can see in that background, it has the right uh, background for Halloween because it, it has a nice witchy purple in the background. Very haunting like eyes and a fall of Hilo's magic within this picture, as you can see. Then, for down to in our next placing at our 45th spot, and that is Yvettel. Here's what Yvettel looks like. Here is the picture. Almost looks like a crow, except it's standing and claws are more out. Because the ear has also the right backing uh, background for Halloween with the nice dark clouds in the background in this picture. As you can see. Down to our 46th placing, we have Darmukaka. Here is a picture of what that looks like. Here it is to you right now. Can't forget the pumpkins. What's happening we without the pumpkins? Here's one for you guys. Goes into a Pokemon. And bringing its place to our 47 spot, and we have is Pumpkaboo. Here's a Pumpkaboo. Boo's like. Here is the picture. Take a look. It looks like a um, interesting looking pumpkin, and it has on top what looks to be like a bat on top. That looks like. But it appears to be like hair, as you can see in the picture. Then we get down to our 48th place. We have Trevenant. Here's that Trevenant looks like. Here is the picture. Well, no, that is incredibly holoistic. You can see the spooky woods, but that itself is a part of the woods. Very hollows like, very haunting, and very chilling. And um, puts this on the list as our top best Pokemon for Halloween. Now that's that is uh, in the right setting and definitely gives the chill that you're looking for. And that's that, we got our turn to our next one, to our next pl placing at our 49th spot. We have. Angusless. Here is what Angusless looks like. Here is the picture. It almost looks like a relic. As you can see here, it has wings, what appears to be like eyes in the middle, and eye on top. And uh, has the right setting of Halloween. You can see in the background there. Um, but what makes it really perf uh, top best po po Pokemon ever to appear on our Halloween Pokemon Special. Or should I say, our Halloween spe Special the, for our Pokemon Edition. And now, let's get on with the rest of the amazing pictures. Okay, now we're going to get down to our next one. This goes into the bat and brings us place number 50. And that is Noibat. Here's what no a Noibat will look like. Here is the picture. Look at that, really big ears and eyes. A very interesting Pokemon. Very interesting and very and very unique. A very unique one as well too. That makes great for the top best Halloween Pokemon. Chandelier comes in to its placing at 51. Here is what that will look like. Here is the picture. Another one that looks very holoistic, like in a castle setting. It has a uh, full flame, haunting, but also has that enriched Halloween feeling within this picture, as you can, as you can see just here. Then to our placing at our 52 uh, second spot, and that is no Noivern. Here's a Noivern. Looks like. Here is the picture. You know that bat one? More of like a vampire almost. Slash. Teddy bear. Like kind of like creature. 
I like a mix of both, making it really haunting, very creepy, but makes a great top best Pokemon for Halloween. Perfect setting in the background, very holistic. Then we get is Gotharita, making its pl place for us at our 53rd spot. Here is a picture of what it looks like. Right setting, you can see on the floor, nice a floor also looks like a haunt, haunted house and it looks like as if that this could be like a doll as you can see just here in the picture Monica haunted doll to be exact then bringing us way down to our next one to our 54th spot we have is Gothelette here's a Gothelette Looks like. Here is the picture. This one here is the evolved form for the picture you've just seen before. Uh, this stat it also puts its way on our top best Pokemon for Halloween. Making its place for us at our 55th spot. And that is... Frill Fish. Frillish, there you go, Frillish. Sorry about that, guys. Um, here is a picture of what that looks like. Almost looks like a ghost standing up and fit for the Hollow Circus, as you can see just right here in the in the picture. Here it kind of looks, makes me kind of like want to laugh with this one, but also makes great for top Poke no, for top best Halloween Pokemon. Here's another bat one for you guys. Um, goes into our 56th place. And that is Golbat. Here is a Golbat. What looks like. Here is the picture to you right now. Deep in the cave comes Golbat. Big wide mouth. Nice wingspan. But makes great for top best Halloween Pokemon. Since we're getting to the bat of it all, here comes a whole bunch of them. And making its place to our 57th spot. And that is Zubat. Here's what Zubat looks like. Here is the picture. Okay, now this is a very uh, interesting looking bat. Now this bat, you can see, is using echolocation. As you can tell by the rounds, what is giving for speech. Nice wingspan. Um, very stretched up. Very Halloween-like, especially in the background of the picture. Before we move on, let's see what Meowth has got himself into now. So now, let's turn on the lights. Whoa! You can see... There's a frog there, and I said he has some treats. But where did he get that from? I think he went trick or... I think he went trick or treating. You can tell by the bag. I swear. And now that we saw me all the way was up to, now let's turn off the lights. Gotta keep the place nice and hollowy, shadowy, as you can see. Fast stat can see, light is bouncing off the Pokemon poster that you'll see just here. And now let's make to our next one. Since we just saw a Zubat for that one, that made its way to our, our uh, 57th. Now, getting down to our next placement. That is our 58th one, and that is a Woo Bat. Here's what Woo Bat will look like. Here is a picture. A very interesting Pokemon. One eye. Purple people eater. <laughs> Joke, it. I just had to. <laughs> but not that, it has bat wings, and it looks like a spiky hairball that you'll see just here. A very interesting, unique Pokemon. Right setting, but makes great for our top Halloween Pokemon. On the list. Now we're gonna get to another bat one for you guys. It's all about the bats in this one. Um, and that is um, to our 59th placement, and that is Crowbat. Here's a cr what Crowbat looks like. Here is a picture. It almost does look like a, a crow. It's kind of like it. Not that in the background, you see there's a full moon. 
the hollow sky and with a nice wingspan. Very haunting eyes and very chilling, a very chilling grin that you'll see on the face in the picture. Number 60, or should I say placement 60, and that is Swoo Bat. Here's what Swoo Bat looks like. Here is the picture. Another very interesting bat Pokemon. Not a stat, you can take a little look. It's very unique, very interesting, but yet still has the bat wings, nice uh, frizzle fray around the neck, pointy ears, animated eyes, and makes great for all top best Halloween Pokemon. Can't forget the snakes in this one. And making its place on our six. The first spot, and that is Survivor. Here's a Survivor. Looks like. Here is the picture. Survivor. Another top best Pokemon ever to make a current couple snake one for Halloween for top best Pokemon. Coming into his place at our, our, our 62nd spot, and that is Ekans. Here's what Ekans looks like. Here is the picture. Ekans. You can see in the eyes, looks like Tiger's eye, right, it's a rattlesnake. But makes great for all top best Pokemon for Halloween. Then we get to our next placement, and that is to our our sixty third one, and that is Dunspur. Here is what this one looks like. Here is the picture of what that will look like. I mean, Dunsprice. Do apologize to that, guys. <laughs> Anyways, here is the picture. Then we get to our next one. And it goes into our 64th place. And that is Weevil. Here's what Weevil will look like. Here is the picture. Look at that. Whoa. That is pretty amazing. Now it's that it has the right setting, holistic look, a haunting kind of look, and you know, that is getting a creepy little show just for you. Now it's that it almost looks like Count Dracula because it's a black, one little fang, and we have the red on top and its tail that you'll see just here in the picture. Then we get to the mega one part, uh, part of this one. And putting it to his place at our 65th spot. And that is Mega Hound Doom. Here's what that looks like. Here is the picture. This one here has all them put together all in one to make it nice and mega. From the other evolutions, submerged together, we get this. It almost looks like more like a hellhound, as you can see in the picture. And that's great for top best Halloween Pokemon ever. Now we get to our next one at its placement at our 66 spot, and that is Jarantina. Here is what Jarantina looks like. Here is the picture. Very holoistic, you can tell in the background. Looks more like those, uh, like the uh, uh, Hellhound that you see seen here, but this one here is like the flying type, basically. Same bone structure, but more different. And it more, looks more like, um, a flying creature, as you can see in the picture. Number 67. We got Zack 2. Here is what Zack, Zack 2 looks like. Here is the picture. Really, ha very Halloween type. On the background. Looks more like a voodoo bird, as you can see just here in the picture. That makes great for all top best Halloween Pokemon that, you'll, that appears on our top 69 on the list. Then we get Sligu at our 68th one. Here is the picture of what Sligu looks like. 
Very Hollywoodic here, very enchanting like, very filled with hocus pocus within this one. And not just that, very chilling because it has a nice warm green, has a green eye, and makes great for all top best Halloween Pokemon ever. Then we get to our final one at our 69th spot. And that is a beware. Here's a beware. Looks like here is the picture. And that is it. And that concludes the video from here. So there was the uh, top best 69 best Halloween um, po Pokemon ever. And again, thank you so much for watching. Coming up, we got Halloween movie collections. As it is, happy November. Because now we've got three days. See how those days, which the collection will take place. I'll see you tomorrow for our all new Halloween movie collections. And again, thank you all so much for watching our all new tricks videos of 2019's Halloween series. Stay tuned for our next one coming up next year in the year of 2020. So please stay tuned for that. And uh, coming up, we got more amazing videos just around the corner. Starting this one off. And I'll greet you back tomorrow with our series of Halloween movies. It's going to be a little bit different. I'll keep you posted with a vlog tomorrow before the, before the starting. Thank you for tuning in and thank you for watching. Don't forget, forget to uh, like, share, and don't forget to subscribe yet. Don't forget to click the subscription button. So you do, you'll be seeing awesome amazing videos just like this and so much more. This is from yours truly, Reese. And yourself, a happy Halloween and a happy November. Ciao for now and I'll see you tomorrow.